Hey everybody, welcome to the Mr. Maple Show. I'm Matt. And I'm Tim. And today we've got a bunch of announcements for you. Some really cool ones from a summer open house announcement to the giveaway winners on the hashtag Native Azalea Contest uh, and some other fun, I think, exciting announcements we're going to be doing here at Mr. Maple as well. Uh, some new content we're trying to bring to our YouTube channel as well as a new YouTube channel as well where we have some extra stuff going on. So we'll start out uh, talking about our summer open house. Yeah, our open summer open house. It's going to be Saturday, September third, uh, and it's also going to be Monday, September fifth. Both days, eight to twelve. That's eight a.m. to noon, and we're we have to be firm on that closing time because we've actually got some family things going on that afternoon. Yeah, Mama's birthday but, party will probably be that fifth. Uh, Mama Maple, if you know my mother, uh, we're having her birthday. It's a big one. It's a big seven zero this year, so we're throwing her a big party with some family. So we'll definitely have to be dipping out. Those times are a firm time. Uh, because of it being so warm, we're only doing 8 to 12. So that'll get you out of here before it gets super hot. We're going to break it into two days to make it easier for you. But we will have to be shutting down really firmly at 12 o'clock. Now what we've been doing here for that open house is we've been carrying up a lot of that stuff if you were here for the spring open house that you couldn't get to down at the bottom of the nursery. And we've been bringing it up to the top of the nursery. So there's a lot more plants up here available for this open house than there was before. I think there might even be three extra greenhouses up above. Oh yeah, there may, we may, who knows how much we get done between now and then too. We're, yeah. we're in the process of putting up more houses. Uh, again, that will be Saturday, September 3rd from 8 to 12 only. And then Monday, September 5th from 8 to 12 only. So we're breaking it in two there. Hopefully by getting in the morning times, we can get you out some of these greenhouses before that peak summer heat. We're hoping this allows us to do a, a summer open house that's going to be fun and memorable, but also easy for you to attend and not something that's going to be too hot or, or too late in the day because there will be some other activities, like I said, going on. But mark your calendars. Both days you're welcome to come. Uh, we're just going to be doing a, a basic open house here with, with uh, you know, we'll be uh, here guiding you around the greenhouses and helping you find some awesome Japanese maples and, and a lot of other cool plants if as you, well. If you thought we had a ton of one gallons in the spring, there's even more <laughs> right. up here for this summer open house. More varieties, more uh, just number of quantity. More things are finished. More things are finished. And the one gallons are huge. Yeah. I mean, a lot of the one gallons are plants that could be put into a three gallon. Mm -hmm. So just some really good sizes right now on those uh, one gallons. So awesome time to come, get some cool maples here at Mr. Maple, September 3rd and September 5th, 8 a.m. to noon. And I'd recommend getting here at 8 a.m. so you can really shop and go through all these greenhouses. It will take you some time because there's a lot to see here uh, at Mr. Maple at these top greenhouses. And the earlier in the day, you know, the, the better it is. Honestly, that's when the peak traffic was for even our spring open house. Um, you know, uh, parking can be crazy, so earlier is always easier. The heat will definitely be a lot less early in the morning, and uh, it, it's a fun time to be in Henderson County. Uh, of course, during Labor Day weekend, the Apple Festival's happening here downtown, so you're welcome to participate in all that craziness if you want to go toward downtown, but we're certainly going to have some fun stuff going on. You can avoid the craziness of downtown, too, if you'd like, and just get over here to Mr. Maple in East Flat Rock, because we'll, uh, we'll be putting up stuff on our website about that, and we'll be putting in our upcoming emails that go out, but we're going to do that summer open house. Again, I'll say it one more time. Saturday, September 3rd from 8 to 12, and that's a hard close at 12. We do have to be firm on that. Uh, Maple Mama's birthday is that day, and we got to take care of her. We're going to do a bunch of fun stuff for her. Monday, September 5th, and again from 8 to 12 only that day. We will be having a regular work day for our employees after that, so we've got to get a few things done. But we think this is the best way to divide the day in two and to give it a little bit of a cooler feel so you're not out here during peak heat. And uh, I think you'll enjoy getting out here and seeing what we've been working on. A lot has changed even since the last open house. Uh, we had about 750 people at the Memorial Day open house. Uh, it was a huge hit. It was one of our biggest days we've ever had here at Mr. Maple. We've had a lot of people asking to get back out here. Uh, I'd love to see y'all. We enjoyed getting out here. I know Brian loved interacting with people and just, just being in, in Maple fans and just enjoying uh, you know, interacting with all y'all. It was certainly a really fun time for us. And so we want to do it again. It was, it was a blast. And if you like the native azalea content you've been seeing, all of our native azaleas are now at the top of the nursery. And that's even plenty of varieties that you've never seen before that haven't made it to a Fun Flower Friday. Uh, so 
a lot of really cool plants and a lot of Japanese maples that have not made it to a 10 at 10. So come be prepared to shop and be prepared to be shocked by some of the cool plants that you see right around here at Mr. Maple. So a couple of channel announcements too. Uh, we're going to be trying something cool this week. Uh, we've decided to release some of our long form content. So like basically when we go and do these epic tours and it's a long adventure, uh, Brian likes to do a director's cut. Really comes out nicely. Sometimes it's fun to present all that content in you know, one format all the way through. We know it's sometimes hard for people to sit through an hour video in the morning. So what we're going to start doing is releasing Mr. Maple movies. And it's going to be the Sunday night movie when we do this. This Sunday at 8 p.m. we're going to air the full cut, the full director's cut that Brian's been working on of the Hopewood Estate. And if this is popular, it may be something we continue to do. It may be an easier format to roll out some of our longest content, and that's going to be at 8 p.m. Eastern. So at 8 p.m. Eastern, you know, most people are at home chilling on a, on a Sunday afternoon. Mm -hmm. I think it's the perfect time for me to sit back and interact with you guys on that content and just, you know, I'll be there commenting under the live stream. We'll premiere these videos then. And uh, I think it's a fun way to air some of this content. We're, we're still going to have a, a 6 a.m. Uh, Mr. Maple Show video that day, so there'll still be the main regular show going on but it's just a fun way to put some of our longer form content out there and maybe in a time frame when you have a little bit more time to check it out. And this isn't saying that we'll be doing this every single Sunday, but when we have a part one, part two, part three of some awesome gardens like the Hoopwood Estate, yeah. or if we had another thing like the Gregory Bald where we've got all these parts, we'll release that director's cut on that Sunday evening because I know a lot of you all have We're going to go to some to pretty work. epic gardens. The garden tour videos have been doing very well here on our channel. Uh, we've requested a lot of them. We've had some long plans on doing some of them. Shoot, some of these gardens we've been trying to get to since, you know, early COVID. So now we're just able to get out and interact mm -hmm. with some of these people again. We've got some really awesome gardens going on. We're doing some special stuff here. We're going to capture some really fun gardens with the same format where we take Brian and Wesley out there and we just, we give you the best picture we can of that content. We're trying to do the best job we can of making it as qual quality as possible. I mean, we're we're a small family business, but we want to put out the best videos possible because of stuff we're passionate about. So uh, that, that's going to be that first movie. That's going to be uh, July 31st. Again, it's going to be Sunday evening. It's the Mr. Maple Sunday night movie. Check it out there. It's going to be at 8 p.m. premiering. Um, I just think it's fun to watch it in long form content, and we greatly appreciate it. Each of those videos are already doing very well on their own. And also, get ready to, because we're going to get back to doing some of those maple talks where we're going in and talking about some amazing maples in a yeah. greenhouse or at a table. We've already shot we, some more maple we, tabletop we, content, we call we it. We shot the Pendulous Treasures collection, which you just a heads up, that's coming out pretty soon. Uh, the already heat, on the table, the Heat Seekers Heat Seekers series, collection. about to be get done, the Ghost series. So we've got some awesome, awesome videos you'll enjoy to watch on Japanese maples as well. So if you love Japanese maples, don't worry. Just because we're doing garden talks, we're and we focus on those maples when we find them in the garden. Mm -hmm. But uh, we're also continuing to do those Japanese maple centric talks as well, which I think you'll really enjoy. Hey, if you can't get enough Mr. Maple content, we've started a B channel. And it's not really a B channel, it's kind of different than a typical B channel. We're doing a Mr. Maple Clips channel. Give them a sub if, you, if, you, if you're really enjoying this content and you like some short form content. Uh, basically, what we're going to throw on here is cultivar related content that isn't going to be in that format on our main channel. So, like, while we're walking around Hopewood, Tim did this really awesome little segment where he talked about the history behind Sky Pencil and Mr. Shibamichi. And we thought it was a great segment, but we didn't want to re-air it on our main channel. So what we did is we're making a Mr. Maple Clips channel for content like that. Currently, it's just a few things, but we're going to continue to add to it. And it may be some content that you missed on our main channel, but it's going to be in a small one to four to five minute max format. So it's a kind of a Clips channel but it'll focus on things that we might not have necessarily highlighted on the main channel, like uh, Stargazer Hydrangea and that, that Sky Pencil. We actually have a video on Makawi Itsabusa there at Hopewood as well. Yep. But we're gonna be doing some more, more small cuts like that, more cultivar centric, but it's a, it's a little bit more clippy, but it's kind of fun too, because you can go through a lot of content fast and you can learn a lot quickly. And it's also gauges whether you want to watch the full video. So hopefully, you know, checking out some of these clips, you'll go like, man, that Hopewood looks pretty cool. I probably should check out the whole thing. I really enjoyed all three segments I saw on that. So it's kind of an idea as an advertisement for the main channel. As it continues to grow, and it's super small, I mean, it's like 25 subscribers when you're watching this, we'll probably do some giveaways over there too eventually as it continues to grow. 
but it's going to be more clip centric for sure. So it's going to be small tidbit content and maybe some original content, uh, you know, down the road. But right now it's going to be mostly clips from the Mr. Maple show. So we've still got a giveaway going on the hashtag Japanese maples. We're giving out a Mr. Maple gift card. And so make sure you're continually putting hashtag Japanese maples. When we get to those 15,000 subscribers, we'll be giving uh, the gift card away then. Uh, but we'll go ahead and get into the gift card. Yeah, we've got uh, the hats that we're giving away right now. Yeah, right now we have the native azalea. It was hashtag native azaleas was how to get uh, you know involved in this giveaway. Basically, what we were doing was trying to get more comments on our native azalea videos. So we wanted you guys to watch this stuff. We put a ton of work into it, from the drone shots to Brian's editing. Uh, to me, hiking up a mountain, that was pretty hard. <laughs> so we wanted, to, uh, we wanted to get this content on as many eyes as possible. And uh, we really appreciate you being a part of that. So we went ahead and gave away five of our camo hats. And uh, these are probably my favorite Mr. Maple hat. I'm not going to lie. I, awesome. get, uh, I get people that aren't even that into horticulture are like, dude, I got to get me one of those camo hats. Uh, you know, shout out to Bad Rabbit, lead singer JP Jangles, like, I need me one of those. So he's out there wearing it sometimes at shows. I went to one of his shows. Felt cool he was rocking the Mr. Maple camo hat at the show. Uh, it's a bit of a popular hat amongst everybody. So uh, we wanted to give away five of these under those hashtag native azaleas. Now, we always make it as fair as possible when we do this. So each time we put all the native azalea videos that were in the contest in the randomizer, then we picked a video, and then we picked a person from their numerically random under that that put in that hashtag native azaleas. So each and every time you entered was a separate individual chance to win. So if your name is, is one of the ones that picked, if you're one of the winners, contact Jody at mrmaplequestions at gmail.com. And once we've confirmed that uh, you are, in fact, this person, uh, we will need your, <laughs> your name, your mailing address, uh, so we can mail you these hats. Nine times out of ten, and I think every time so far, we've done a lot of giveaways. We give away some t-shirts, we give away some hats already. I'm most of them are customers, so we already have you in the system, so it's pretty easy. You just say, hey, Jody, uh, last order was this order number, and we just plug you right in. We already know where to ship to. So winner number one on video part one. So this was under the Gregory Bald part one is Andrew Lovejoy. Andrew Lovejoy, we're going to send you out a hat. We greatly appreciate you uh, plugging along there. Part one was more of the setup style video. So we're like, hey, this is why we're going to go do that hike to Gregory Bald. And uh, just really enjoyed that whole thing. I think, too, as we get into next year, pre-Azalea season, those videos are really going to get popular as people are Googling Hooper Bald and Gregory Bald, some of these really fun places we went to. Uh, I'll let you go ahead and announce the next winner there. Yeah, so basically, again, we randomized all the videos the second, vi the second winner went to part four, uh, and it went to Cindy L. And so, Cindy L., you've got a camo hat coming your way. Just contact Jody through Mr. Maple Questions. That's Mr. Maple Questions with an S at gmail.com. Hey, I greatly appreciate you, Cindy L. I accidentally deleted Cindy L. the other morning because I was deleting some spam comments, and I deleted one of her comments, and then I felt terrible. So, I'm glad she won a hat. We appreciate all your comments. You're always so kind to uh, chime in there. I see some more familiar faces in here. The next winner was under part two, so that was Gregory, Paul, uh, Gregory Bald part two, and that is Alvin Whitley. Alvin's a long-term customer. Uh, greatly appreciate you, Alvin. We've got a camo hat sending out your way right away. Just contact Jody at MrRapleQuestions at gmail.com just to confirm your address to make sure we're sending the hat where you want it to be sent. Uh, the next, the fourth winner goes to Ice Cold Dan 26 it says Ice Cold Dan 26. So contact Jody at Mr. Maple Questions at gmail.com. Sounds like a cool guy to me. Yeah, me too. And uh, part two was what he won that one under. And then last but not least, we actually gave away uh, a hat. The winner to this hat came under the giveaway contest video. So that was the video where we announced the contest. And that went to Obsessed with Lawn and Odds with GR. So Obsessed with Lawn and Odds GR. Contact Jody. We've got a camo hat for you. Those are our current five giveaway winners. Uh, we're going to close the native, the hashtag Native Azalea challenge, but don't forget, we're actually giving away $100 in Mr. Maple gift cards. We're going to be giving away four of those that are $25 each that, that add up to $100 when we get that 15,000 subscribers. We're actually closing on that pretty quickly, so that things are moving pretty fast on that. To participate in that gift card giveaway, all you have to do is put in hashtag Japanese Maple. 
On any video. On any single video ever, and you're entered to win. It can be old videos. It can be new videos. In mm -hmm. fact, those old videos, you've got a really good chance, chance to win, to win because yeah. there's less people who are going and commenting on this. I like the really clever people while we're doing this one that put in, like, native azaleas, hashtag Japanese maple. I'm like, now that's how you play right there. Uh, they're double dipping. I, I, I respect the game. <laughs> so, hey, we greatly appreciate all of our contestants in this. Um, we're working on getting some more affordable merch. Uh, so uh, I've been talking to Amy uh, recently. My wife's decided to stay home with our three kids, so she'll have more time uh, with our family, but also to work on some side projects here. So we're going to be doing more cool hats, more cool t-shirts. That means more cool giveaways. So we'll be giving away more Mr. Maple stuff right here on the channel. Uh, you can always watch our giveaway videos to see how to be entered to win those. And there'll be some fun stuff on the way there for sure. Take care. God bless. And have a great day.